welcome back, everyone. Well, we've been listening to the music of Peter Conrad. He's kind of had his hands full lately. Mm -hmm. uh, I yeah. a, have a CD out called Dream Come True, which was Correct. one of the tracks we just heard from. Um, and you've already started on the next one, so I'm sure you have a, your, your plate pretty full right now. It's pretty you? full, yeah, but I'm having a good time uh, working on the second one and uh, doing my hosting duties, trying to keep my band together. And now, no, today it's just you, but you right. do have... Uh, some of the other bands. I think you brought with you a little bit of some some of the footage from the Dolphin Lounge. Correct, correct. And it's the whole band. It's the whole band and a couple extra people, some folks that actually played on my CDs from the CD release party. Okay, and, and who, like, how, can, what are the members of the okay, band? Okay, Mr. Joel Guild, uh, lead guitar, Lloyd Morrison, bass guitar, Rich Roman drums, uh, Bud Wise saxophones, Bob Evans keyboards, and Miss Gail Carafell on the vocals. Oh, great. All right. Oh, there they are. There, there they are. There, Better there they are now. And it looks like you guys are just having lots of fun. Having a real good time up there. Just so you're going to have away. to bring them all in here sometime. Get the whole, well, get the whole crew we'll in. have to come in at five. Oh, that's, <laughs> all right. that's all right. We can handle it. We can handle it. The Dolphin but Lounge, that's to. a place known yeah. for just having open mic jams. It's the home of the jams. We do blues on Mondays, Tuesdays acoustic, Wednesdays and Thursdays variety. Yeah. Saturday is the electric open stage with myself and my band. Uh, now, I was when you first came into the studio earlier. I just want to say, have you ever heard that you look like somebody? I I uh, have, as a matter of fact. Uh, didn't you see my movie last night? <laughs> yeah, I think that you could have done a better job. You yeah, I, yeah. yeah I, I, every day, I bet I've heard it. <laughs> every, and I've signed his autograph once. Oh, really? Once. One time. Yeah, I, I told the lady I was not John Denver. It was the Ohio State Fair. She insisted. After three tries, I signed, best wishes, John Denver. You last. So. <laughs> <laughs> Your glasses need to be a little bit smaller, and then you'd, yeah. you'd be good to go. Yeah. Well, let's talk music. We know Alrighty. you, we know you like Bob Denver. What are you working on these days? I mean, the CD, how, how did the big CD release party go? The CD release party was awesome. All my friends were there. We had a good turnout. I've sold enough CDs to justify doing a second one. Of course. And I'm working on that already. I've got about five or six tracks done. And wow. who are some of your inspirations for the Beatles, the Rolling Stones, and the Who? I can tell the Beatles. Wow. I definitely Three. can see the Beatles. Yeah. And what about for the material? You had a, some love songs. Right. I, I know. I'm thinking that From one of heart. those was about your wife. As a matter of fact, two of them were about my wife. Okay. Uh, tomorrow's her birthday, so oh, uh, well, hey. Happy birthday. One, one to do some songs for her, but yeah, the, all my songs are personal. That's the only way I know how to write. Mm -hmm. So I just write by what I know and my observations. Now, do you want to travel or are you going to go other places? Where are you going to go from here? Uh, I'd uh, like to go to the top, Johnny. There you yes. go. <laughs> uh, wherever it takes me. Uh, right now, it's just a fun hobby. Mm -hmm. And uh, I'm pushing it as far as I can and still trying to be a family man and work. Uh, so we'll see where it goes, one step at a time. One step. One step at a time. Just enjoy it as it goes. Exactly. Keep playing. It's taken me this far, and uh, thanks for having me here today. So oh, appreciate it. Hey, maybe it'll take me further. Uh, I certainly hope so. Well, what do you think about the Columbus music scene? We have all kinds of different music on this I show. think it's awesome. I think Columbus is one of the best uh, music scenes. People need to find out more about it. There's live music every night somewhere in Columbus. There's blues, jazz, rock. Hip hop, everything is happening in this town. You just got to go look for it. Now, what's your style? What's your my, my style is rock and roll with a touch of pop uh, and some uh, blues. When we play live with the band, we do a lot of blues. We do some covers, but we try not to limit ourselves to one sound and one style. And how did you get started in music? Saw the Beatles on Ed Sullivan. That was my big thing. My mom bought me a guitar and. Uh, it's my therapy. It's my love. So I wonder how many kids saw the Beatles <laughs> and Ed Sullivan and their mom bought them a guitar. I'm thinking. Oh, I'm sure a few. lot because all my buddies have. Them and, uh, <laughs> and and the group that you have now, the Peter Conrad uh, band, mm -hmm. does it stay the same? Pretty much every. The week? lineup. I'm glad you asked me that. Uh, it's Joel Guild on guitar. He's also my producer. Uh, we've been together three years. We're a constant. Lloyd Morrison, our bass player, has been with us for two and a half. It's always us three. Okay. The drummers, we kind of rotate through drummers. Drummers seem to be a little hard to keep. Mm -hmm. And uh, I add and drop bass, uh, I'm sorry, saxophone players and keyboard players off and on. But the three of us are the main band. Do you play any other instruments besides the guitar? I play keyboard, well, harmonica, play keyboard. and a uh, little bit of slide, bass, guitar. Mm -hmm. you got to play everything when you're the host of an open stage. Oh, yes, <laughs> or at least pretend like you Or at you least do pretend it. like you can, because <laughs> I'm called upon to back a lot of people up on whatever instrument is lying around. Well, now, we have, we have lots of uh, potential musicians here in Columbus mm -hmm. that, that haven't really gone out anywhere and played out. 
but want to get their feet wet. Can you kind of explain how something like the open mic works? Because sometimes it's a little intimidating. Oh, for I'd people. be glad to. Uh, the way the open mic works, uh, you come out, you find yourself a bar that does the type of music you like, you look for an open stage format, and uh, you perform whatever you feel comes from your heart, whatever's, but not what you want people to think people want to hear, what you want to play. If you come to one like mine, you'll find other musicians that will get behind you and, number one, back you up, play your music for Does you, support you. Does anyone laugh at and point no, Nobody booze. laughs. No booze. No yeah. booze. No, that's an amazing thing. No matter where you go, I, no one booze. And uh, from the worst to the best, everyone gets support. And from going to these, you then meet other people. You make contacts. Uh, it's amazing what you can do. It's just absolutely amazing. It's the best place to start, I think. So do it. Just head on just over do to it. the just Dolphin bring your Lounge. Just guitar and get up there, and other people jump right That's in. That's right. Now, yeah. Dave, he does a little freestyle kind of poetry. Why you got to me could, he do, could people that do poetry even sure. on stage? I, we've had that. Yeah. All right. So we've, anything goes at the Dolphin Lounge. We've had poetry. We've had Edgar Allan Poe readings. Uh, we've had dance. You name it. We, we do it. We do it all. Well, if you need a drummer, Rebecca also is a drummer. If you guys didn't know that. <laughs> I'm always looking for a drummer. Oh, yeah. yeah that's her, Definitely. That's your gig. You know. know the basic beat, and that's about it. <laughs> all right. Well, thanks for being <laughs> thanks here with us it. today. Thanks for we having me. We wish you the me. best of luck with your next CD. Please come back when it's finished. Oh, so I will. We I will. Listen. And um, we're not done with you yet. we got one more one song. More. Wonderful. All right. If you want to find out more about the open mic, mm -hmm. um, you can contact the Dolphin Lounge. Um, Peter hosts Saturday night, but there's all sorts of things going on all week long. It's 475-9944. And if you want to find more out about the Peter Conrad Band, they have a website, www.hometown.aol.com slash PeterJudyC, <laughs> or just email him, PeterJudy at PeterJudyC at AOL.com. Mm -hmm. It never used to be like that. No, now no. you have so yeah, many emails yeah. and websites, i got to take a commercial break. We'll be right back right. with more music. I'm